hello viewers you're welcome to my channel ken Wolves tv you're welcome please if you have not subscribed to my channel please what are you waiting for subscribe to my channel okay today we are going to be preparing delicious ogbono soup ogbono soup as you can see i'm preparing my stock preparing my stock to taste preparing your stock to taste you add your pepper you also add salt you also add your seasoning cubes make it ready and add your seasoning cubes remember you have to cook your stock to taste your stock to taste because it's the stock that you're going to use in preparing your soup and lastly you add your sliced onions and cover the pot i like to cook properly right now the stock is ready the soup is ready the stock for the soup is ready rather you can see you have to stir it i am stirring it because i want everything to mix together are you seeing my stock i am stirring it what i have in my stock is my cow head for my husband beef for my children because i prefer giving my children beef i have stock fish to give my soup that taste that i want this is my stock fish you have the head you also have the ear this is my smoked fish for my obono soup my love for smoked fish in obono soup can not be over underestimated rather so are you seeing my stock you stir it and about to set aside so i'll keep it aside here i'll dry my pot make it ready for my soup i'm not frying the soup mind you i have to dry my cooking pot get a dry pot before i start cooking add my red oil just little the red oil to give my soup that red look that i want that's my oil after adding the oil i reduce my heat a little and then add my oil burner my blended oil burner i'm not frying it i just want the oil burner to mix very well with my oil I just want my obono to mix very well with my oil and I'll stir it, stir it a bit, stir it a bit and add my already prepared stock. Mind you, the stock must be cooked to taste because you're not adding any other thing in this obono soup again other than those ones that won't need too much boiling. At this point, I'll add my prepared stock. okay i've just added my prepared stock i'll stir it stir it to allow everything to blend together to mix very well after stirring it that much i will now cover it to boil a bit before adding other things okay my people our soup is almost ready see soup oh. are you seeing the face of my soup are you seeing the face of my soup so at this point i will stir the soup i'll stir it properly i have my blended pepper and blended crayfish aside so now i'll add my blended pepper and my blended crayfish the reason why i left it to this point is because i like adding fresh pepper almost at the finishing of ogbono soup because of the taste and aroma that it gives so my pepper is not completely blended it's halfway blended my crayfish same way you need to be here and have the aroma it's giving i also add my wash periwinkle and sliced kanda sliced animal skin as a river's gay i really don't cook without periwinkle so i'll add my periwinkle at this point and my sliced kanda which is another word called animal skin you need to be here to know the feeling i am having cheese you can come with any choice of swallow this soup goes with any choice be it fufu eba which is gari which is also called cassava fufu gari comes from cassava you can also go with your weight you can also go with your semo any choice of swallow would go for it so i will stir it i like to blend and blend blend very well and mix the soup very well then cover it and allow it to boil for a few minutes before adding my last ingredients 
I'll just open my pot again. It's boiling. About to add my last ingredient. I told you earlier that it's meaning just one thing, and that one thing is my vegetable leaf, neatly sliced vegetable leaf, ugu leaf. That's what we call it here in Nigeria, ugu leaf, neatly sliced. So this is the last ingredient that I'll be adding to this soup. I will stir the soup. Are you saying the soup? I'll keep stirring it, stirring it, stirring it because at this point it's not going to take more than three minutes. Just after three minutes, I'll take it off my fire because I don't want to kill the potency of my vegetable. I still want that green look of my vegetable to be visible. So my people, please, if you're just joining us, if today is your first time of watching our content, please like our content, comment on our content and subscribe on our, to our channel. Subscribe to our channel, please and please. I'm begging you. Without your subscription, we are nothing here. Please subscribe to my channel. So, I'm about to turn off my gas. Thank you very much for being. See you.